Welcome to Baller or Bust, where we test FIFA cards so you don't have to. If you're here from TikTok, welcome. This is my real voice, not AI generated like I do on TikTok. Because that one's quick, it's easy, it's nice, it's smooth, you know? Anyways, we've got this Sergi Darter butt fantasy card. Costs us like 170k. Pretty expensive for another Spanish midfielder. Way to recycle EA. That's all we get this year, Spanish midfielders. His stats look decent, 92 composure, 90 sprint speed, 88 agility, 82 defensive awareness. Those are the key ones I'm seeing here. Unfortunately, he does have medium, medium work rates. Kind of a problem for midfielders, because, you know, defensively he's just not getting back. Offensively he's just not jumping in. He's kind of just staying in the mid, which is kind of weird for high level gameplay. He isn't overly defensive or overly offensive, basically is what I'm saying. Basically, unless you control him on defense, he's just not really there. You know, if you have guys like Thurum or, or even Cruz, those guys are a little bit closer to your center backs. They're playing more back. They're getting more involved in the defensive game. Darter just doesn't really do that. He kind of just hangs out in the midfield, doesn't really want to get back with those medium work rates. Same thing offensively. He doesn't jump in on the quick counterattacks unless you make him make that run yourself. If you're not controlling him, he's not doing too much with those work rates. He just doesn't really want to get on defense, doesn't really want to get on offense. He's just hanging out in the midfield, which isn't great if you're running a, a, you know, like a 4 triple 2 like I am, where you have two midfielders doing most of the work in the middle. He does have good passing. He's Spanish. Of course he does. His dribbling is also decent. Doesn't feel like the 90 on his face card, but he's also pretty quick. The problem here is you look at other midfielders with really good passing like Pirlo, and they're just not used by the elite players. They're not used by the pros. They're not, you know, it's just not a card that fits into the game. Even Pirlo has better dribbling and passing than Darter does. So you see what I'm getting at. He's just not a special card. The card is decent. If you're going to complete him, you'll get a decent card. But for 170k, it's just not worth it. Even with the upgrades that he could potentially get to an 89, maybe a 90 overall, there just isn't enough there for him to do it, for it to be worth it. You know, he's not there, and you can't change that even with stats. With medium, medium work rates, he just won't do what you want him to do. For a couple games, I subbed him off at half and tried an alternative in the same game. Other players were way more involved in the play. I subbed on the likes of Thurum or uh, Rovella Future Stars, and they just did way more. They were way more involved in the game on both fronts. So that being said... This starter is just really not worth it. It's overpriced. It's another Spanish midfielder. There's a ton of alternatives if you need a Spanish midfielder for chemistry. So, therefore, he is a 